This video will teach you how to play Math Mastermind during the CIMOC contest. Each question in Math Mastermind is worth one mark. There will be two rounds in total. Round one will have 20 questions and a time limit of 20 minutes. The teams will have to collaborate, teach and learn from one another in this round as they work together to solve all the questions as quickly as possible. During Math Mastermind, the team will be in the same breakout room with the same team leader as before. Once everyone is ready, the team leader may start sharing his or her screen. Once the screen is shared, the invigilator will give the login details in the Zoom chat. The team leader will then input the username and password as given. Once logged in, the team may then wait for the invigilator to give the security key. Once the team is ready, the leader may enter the security key code and click on enter to enter the competition. Once entered, the timer will start counting down and the team may start answering the questions. They may discuss with each other through Zoom or the Zoom chat. Once they have come to a conclusion, the leader may start entering their answers in the answer value box. When they are done with one question, they may then move on to the next, and so on. Once the team have answered all questions, the team leader may then click on the red finish button to submit their answers. Once submitted, they may then log out and wait for further instructions. After round one, round two will commence when the team is ready. Round two will have 18 questions and a time limit of 18 minutes. In round two, each team member is assigned to answer two questions by themselves. The invigilator will deduct two points from the team score if the team is caught helping each other. And the question that they are working on will be forfeited. Before the round two contest, the team members should discuss and decide on the sequence of answering the questions. Once decided, the leader may enter the sequence into the Zoom chat to inform the invigilator. In this case, Amy will go first, then Eugene, then Wahida. Once the sequence have been decided and informed, the invigilator will then give the login details for round two. The leader may input the username and password to log in to the contest system. Once here, the team will inform the invigilator that they are ready and the invigilator will give the security key code. Once entered, the timer will start counting down and the first assigned member may start answering the questions. Once he or she finished, the second member may start answering their assigned question. In this case, Eugene has submitted his answer in the Zoom chat. The leader may then transfer the answer into the online contest system. Once the second member has finished, they may then move on to the third member to finish his or her assigned questions and so on. Once the team has finished and the leader has transferred all the answers, they may then decide to submit the contest. The leader can click on the finish button to submit their answers. Once submitted, the leader may stop sharing the screen and the team may then wait for further instructions. Thank you.